Hello my lovelies, I really hope you're all doing really really well, um, I'm really sorry that I didn't upload the last few days of Vidmas, I have unfortunately been really unwell, um, I've had the flu and tonsillitis which is why I still sound like quite unpleasant, um, but today what should have been yesterday's video i am doing a what i got for christmas video now i got very very spoiled this year so this may be quite a long video i really hope it's not but so i'm going to try and like keep it down but um there is one thing that i'd like to mention first that i can't show you because it's currently downstairs and that is i got um another elephant cushion from my mum you may have seen in some of my earlier videos that i had an, i showed an elephant cushion um, and that was for my mum and um, she got me a second one to match it this year which is amazing and the other thing that I can't show you is actually in the wash at the moment and that is a gorgeous dark purple jumper which again my mum got me um, but as I said it's in the wash so I can't really show you so I just have all of the things around me so I'm just going to grab them and show you as we go and just tell you who it's from and the first thing that the biggest thing that I've got here is this this is a vanity case that I got from ah, my mum and this is obviously one to either store my makeup in or to take with me when I go out on jobs so yeah um I think my mum got this from Primark so I will try and find it and link everything down below for what I can find um but yeah so my vanity case which is really cool it's got I've already put some makeup in it but it's got like the two pull apart drawers and then a storage section underneath and yeah it's um ooh. yeah that was that was really cool um and the next thing this I got from my father-in-law and this is a Harry Potter colouring book so I'm very happy about that I went out and bought myself some pencils yesterday so that I can I can do this in my my downtime but yeah, I absolutely love that. Um, the next thing that I have, this was from my partner. My partner makes me a stocking and gets me some presents every year, which is really, really nice. And this is this was one of the presents. This is the NYX HD Studio Finishing Powder, which I've always wanted to try. I've never given it a go, so I'm really, really looking forward to trying that. And for some reason, my partner got me an awful lot of NYX makeup this year, which I'm not complaining. Like, he, it was amazing, but... Yeah, there's a lot of NYX makeup, and this is the, I've never actually heard of this before, the NYX Three Steps to Sculpt set, Sculpt. So it comes with a contour shade, a powder, and, no, a highlighter and a powder. So that's really cool. This is the, um, the lightest shade they had, which is fair. Um, but yeah, so it's a really nice big pan, which is quite nice. Um, and yeah, comes with the three bits in it. So that's really, really cool. Um... This was something that was in my stocking for my partner, and um, yeah, I really like it. This is the Tanya Burr Lip Balm, and it comes in like a penny, and it's peppermint scented. Um, I have tried it a couple of times. It's a bit of an odd colour, like it's a really pale pink, but once you've sort of rubbed it into your lips, it's kind of disappears. But yes, peppermint scented, and it's called Find a Penny, Pick It Up, and it's a little penny, which is really cute. <coughs> Okay, the next thing that I have in my pile, this was my main present from my partner, and this is the Kat Von D Chrysalis Palette. It's one that I've been after for a really long time, and it's it's absolutely gorgeous. It's absolutely stunning. I can't believe that he got it for me. I was super happy. I've been wearing it quite a lot um, in the couple of days after Christmas, and I wore it on Christmas Day, and I absolutely love it. It's so beautiful. Um, it swatches really well. It blends really well. It looks really, really nice on the eyes and it applies really nicely. But this obviously isn't a review about that. So I will be putting a review of that up on my blog um, at some point. And yeah, so up next is my main present from my mum and it is this. It's a little Canon camera. It's the Canon Ixus camera. Um, obviously at the moment I'm filming on my laptop, but I will be starting to film on this. And it comes with like a tripod and all of the other little bits with it. And yeah, so I'm very, very happy that my mama got me my camera. And the next thing that I have to show you, my mum made me like a little, a little wicker basket just full of little things. 
um, which I really appreciate. Um, my mum knows that I collect um, old makeup compacts. Um, I have a few. I've got one from the 30s with a Piero the Clown on it, and I have a couple of others. And she gave me this one. This was actually my nan's, um, who has now passed away. Um, but this is about 70 years old. I've had to clear it. It did actually come with the makeup powder in it. I've had to clear the makeup powder out. It's incredibly heavy. It's incredibly heavy. It's solid French silver. And it's about 70 years old. Um, so this was uh, a present that was like very, very close to my heart. I am very much in love with it. Okay, the next thing, this was in my um, Christmas stuffing as well from my partner. And it's, I'm going to warn you now, there are swear words on it. But um, my, I'm a big, big reader. I love reading. And my partner bought me this bookmark. And it says, fuck off, I'm reading seriously off you fuck and it's like a magnetic bookmark so you put it over the page that you're on and it magnetizes shut so that's really handy and I've been using that and I really like it I think it's a really funny little like present I just think it's really funny and it's really cute and I'm knocking things over um I really love it um, the next thing I have to show is another present that I got from my partner and it is a notebook. He gets me one a, a notebook every single year because I love notebooks. Um, and this is just a new um, a new vibe laptop. Uh, laptop. It's not a laptop, is it? It's a notepad and it's kind of got like a marble effect on the front. And it's really, really cool. I really, really like it. It's a really nice size. It's handy for me to either keep in my bag or I'm, I'm probably going to use it for YouTube notes and stuff. But yeah. So I got that. Uh, the next thing I got was also from my partner. He spoiled me immensely this year. And it's this. And this is the Harry Potter The Ultimate Quiz Book. It is unofficial. And it is unauthorised. However, it's really, really good fun. I've been sort of going through it and answering some questions to see how, much, how well I know Harry Potter. And yeah, it's been really good fun to do that. Um, the next thing, this was from my stocking as well. And this is the this is a Blackhead X pore strip by Pilaten, which I've never heard of before. And it's only like a little sachet, but I thought it'd be really cool. It'd be good fun to use. It's it's one of those like pore strip things that you peel off. So that'll be really good fun. I'm looking forward to to playing with it. Okay, uh, the next thing that my partner got is another thing that he seems to get me every single Christmas, and that is a diary, which I absolutely adore. I love. Like nobody else ever thinks about buying diaries. So it's really handy when you get one for Christmas. And it's this. Like, look at that. It's super cool. So it's got Ariel, Cinderella, um, Belle and Rapunzel. And it's in a sort of like pop art kind of style. Um, 2018 diary, obviously. So, yeah, I'm very much looking forward to using this in 2018 for keeping appointments and dates and stuff in. So that'll be really handy. Okay, uh, the next thing that I received, I actually received two of these. Um, I think my partner, I can't find the other one, sorry, I'm just like lurching in the boobs, showing you my boobs. I think my mum and my partner kind of thought the same thing, but I've got two brush belts now, which is really handy, so I'll be using this one for um, going on jobs and stuff like that, so I'll take that one with me because it's smaller and it's a lot easier to carry about. And this is the one that my partner got me, which will be my my own personal brush belt. Um, it's from Superdrug, so I will try and link it down below. Um, but this is sort of like a twofer. Um, so I have my brush belt, which is obviously one of my presents. And inside are some of my favourite presents. And these, again, are what my partner bought me. And as I've mentioned, I am a large Harry Potter fan. So my partner bought me some of the Storybook Cosmetics brushes which are the metal brushes with the wand handles. I am absolutely in love. They did come in a really, really gorgeous felt bag, and like a velvet bag. Unfortunately, I can't touch velvet, hence why I put them in my brush belt, because that will make life so much easier. But they're just, they're so stunning, and they're very heavy, they're very well made, they're very good quality. So again, I will link obviously everything down below, but yes, I've been a spoiled lady this year. I really have been, like, immensely spoiled. 
The next thing I have is I think it's something that like everybody gets at Christmas, but it's just a box of Maltesers. These came in my Christmas stocking. I can't really say much about them, can I? They're Maltesers. So. Okay, the next thing I got was something from my mum, which is really cool. It came wrapped in this box, and I thought, oh, well, she got me. And it's a really cool, it's a leather throng necklace um, with, a jade, with a jade crystal and a dragon wrapped around it. And it's really cool. Like, my mum knows how much I love dragons and fantasy and stuff like that. And, yeah, so something like this is really cool for me, and I really love it. I, I probably won't wear it very often just because I, I'll worry about losing it or breaking it, but... It's absolutely beautiful, and I love it. It's really cool. So, yeah. Um, the next thing, um, that came in that weird little, like, wicker basket that my mum made me. And this was another thing that came in it as well. And I didn't know what it was until I opened it. But it's super cool. It's like a little, it's like a tiny jewellery box. So, yeah, you have, like, the little portion there for, like, rings and earrings and stuff. And then you can just clip it up and zip it. And I think that's really, really cool. Like, that's really handy to have. Because, you know, if you've got, like, a giant jewellery box, you've then got to store that. And if your house gets burgled, people know what jewellery boxes look like. Like, if I have my jewellery in that and it's just, like, under my bed or whatever, no one's going to know what that is, are they? Like, let's be honest. So, yeah, that's super cool. And I'm really, really happy with it. So, yeah. Um, I did actually get, I got two presents that I had to open with just me and my partner. Um, and the first, I thought they were going to be something like really inappropriate, like some nice lingerie or something that I didn't really want to open in front of my mum and the kids. But no, he'd actually really sweetly bought me a pair of Christmas pyjamas and Christmas slippers to wear. So I'm going to show you the pyjama bottoms. I haven't got the top because that's actually in the wash. But these are the bottoms and they're Harry Potter pyjamas and they've got like moons and stars and scrolls with mischief managed written on it and the top is like a burgundy top with the words sorry i'm actually in my bed because i'm still feeling really rubbish um and on the top it's like a burgundy top which says i solemnly swear i'm up to no good um so they were really cool and the second present that i got were these little slippers they're little tatty teddy slippers and they're the little slip on fluffy pump things which i really like i don't often wear anything on my feet when I'm in the house because I don't want my feet to be encased but sometimes that can be a bit dangerous so pardon me so yeah I got some little slippers um and the next thing I have here again was in my Christmas stocking and they're just some face wipes these are the pure ones that you get from like Poundland and um yeah I got two packs of these all wrapped up in my Christmas stocking um because you can never have too many packs of face wipes you just can't. As a woman and, and, and a makeup lover, you can't. So, yeah. And the next thing that I have to show you are these. My mum bought me these to decorate my um, vanity case. And I have these big, like a big sheet of... These are pearls. And I have another sheet of, like, little gems and stuff. So they're really cool. I think they're awesome. And they're, they're going to be pretty handy to have about. To do whatever with. So, yeah, um, the next thing was another present from my partner, and this was the Body Shop Almond Milk and Honey Scrub. It smells absolutely delightful. What of it I can smell. I'm sure once my nose has sorted itself out, I'll be able to smell it better. But, oh, smells lovely, and it's just a lovely little gift to give someone, I think, these sorts of things. They make people feel really good and sort of pampered, and, yeah, they always make you feel really good. Okay, the next thing was a present from my dad. Now, my dad always buys me very strange gifts. Like, I don't know where he gets his ideas from. But this year, he bought me a universal battery charger. <laughs> now, I can see where he was coming from, um, because I have the camera and things like that. And I do have quite a lot of, like, battery-operated equipment in my house. That sounds a bit weird. Um, so he bought me this, it's a battery charger, you can use it to charge any kind of battery, you can use it to charge phone batteries with a lead, anything, so that's going to be pretty handy to have around the house, however it is a slightly odd present to buy your daughter, but I can see where he was coming from, bless him. <laughs> okay, uh, the next thing, this is something my mum buys for me again every year, normally I just get the normal rum truffles, but she thought I'd like to try these ones, and these are mini chocolate and orange truffle cakes, and they're absolutely delicious. They're so nice. Um, and ever since I've tried them one year, she's just bought them for me every year. And I think it's kind of sweet. Like, 
you know you always have that one present you expect to get and that's mine <coughs> sorry okay uh the next thing that i have in front of me is this and this is the derma v10 night cream um and this is something that my partner bought me it's very thick it does smell kind of medicinal almost like it's doing something like you can sort of smell it doing something if you like but yeah so I, I felt a bit offended at first like oi I don't need like an overnight cream how rude but I can see its purpose like it's nice to put on last thing at night before we go to bed okay now <laughs> the next thing I'm going to show you is again I'm pretty sure every single person child whatever in England who has a Christmas stocking receives these every year chocolate coins I don't really need to say much more do I <laughs> Okay, um, the next thing that I have is again something that I got in my Christmas stocking and this is professional makeup brush cleaner that um, I initially thought it was nail polish remover but it's not, it's makeup brush cleaner but um, yeah always handy to have when you use a lot of makeup brushes and you're doing jobs and stuff so sorry always handy to sort of have it lying around isn't it. Okay uh, the next thing that I have here is these Harry Potter Bertie Bots Every Flavour Beans. Now, these are terrifying. I'm not going to lie. I've eaten like three and I'm a bit nervous to even to even go near them. But these are the flowers that you have. You have earwax, earthworm, dirt, cinnamon, cherry, candy floss, bogies, blueberry, black pepper, banana, grass, green apple, marshmallow rotten egg sausage lemon soap tutti frutti vomit and watermelon so there are some very nice lovely sounding ones in there but there are obviously some very revolting sounding ones in there so i'm a little bit scared but this is such a cool present okay the next thing this is i think well, this is another one of the presents from my part, Anna, and it's the Snowella Zoella Body Mist, and this smells really, really nice. This is, like, the, the big bottle, I think, and it comes with an annoying pom-pom, which is annoying, I'm not going to lie. It's very pretty for the whole aestheticness of it, but it's really irritating. Um, but it smells really cool. It looks really nice just, like, up on your side, and I really like it, so, yeah. Okay, uh, the next thing that I have here is this, and again, this is something that I get every year. People like to buy me like little shower gels and stuff because again, it's that sort of thing that's sort of like it's nice to feel a bit pampered. And this is the Imperial Leather Marshmallow one, which I'm sure you all have heard of. Um, but yeah, so the, I know that I like this one. I know that it smells nice, so I'm really happy with that. Okay, uh, the next thing I show you is actually a set, so I have them here, so I'm just going to sort of sort them out on my hands for you. Now, these probably look slightly odd, and you probably don't know what they are, and I'm really finding, I'm just going to hold one, because I'm finding them really difficult to hold. There are actually five of them, but these are base perfumes, almost, so they're the purest scents and there's not a lot of them if you know what I mean so you can sort of layer so for example this one is lime and nutmeg um, you have pink pepper and grapefruit lemon and ginger blood orange and basil and white peach and coriander so I like to wear like the white peach and coriander with my zoella body mist um, they are very very concentrated which is a bit scary but they're they're a lovely present and I'm really really pleased they were from my mum and they're absolutely lovely so yeah and the last things I have to show you are all makeup I got a lot of makeup this year um and this was again in my stocking and this is the makeup gallery color matters matte top coat for your nails obviously and I think it's super cool like I haven't tried it yet but I'm really really looking forward to so yeah and the next thing, which is was slightly terrifying and looks like it could be weaponized, I'm sure some of you recognize this. This is the NYX uh, Precision Brow Pencil, and it's what I've got on my brows at the moment. I really, really like this. It does give me slightly more bolder eyebrows than I'm used to, but considering that a man bought this, he did a really frigging good job with the color. Like, I'm not even joking. He did a really good job. 
Um, it's a really lovely pencil. It's nice and soft. It gives just the right amount of kind of colour and definition and depth and all that nonsense. And I really, really like it. So that's really cool. And the next thing, again, came as a set. This was one of the, I don't know if you've seen them. They're like these double-ended weird stick things. And in one end you have something that's clear and in the other end you have a colour. I thought it was something for your lips. It's not. It's something for your nails. And so at one end you have step two, which is the top coat. And um, step one, you have the colour. And he got me Keep Magenta. And it's the colour I have on my nails at the moment. I really, really like it. It's really nice. And, yeah, they're really lovely little nail polishes. They're really good. And I have one other nail polish to show you. And it is this one. This is the Maybelline Colour Show in the shade Orchid Violet. And, again, this is a really nice colour. I really, really like it. It's really pretty. So, yeah. And the last two things came together, and these are both NYX eye pencils. Um, this one is Black Sparkle, so it's a black sparkly one. And this one is, I think, like, Tropical Green or something, so that one's, like, a really bright green. And when I say it's really bright, I am not joking. It's really bright. Um, I am wearing a dark green dress on new year's eve so i'm thinking of maybe doing something with this with it um but yeah so that is everything that i got for christmas guys i'm sorry that the studio has been so long i really hope you've enjoyed it and i'm sorry that it's a day late but i will be back tomorrow with another video for you of um my new year's resolutions so i will see you all tomorrow Bye bye